Ever found yourself throwing away spoiled food because you didn't store it properly? It's a common scenario, isn't it? You purchase a cart full of fresh produce and meats, only to find them spoiled before you have a chance to enjoy them. It's not just about the disappointment of missing out on that fresh salad or juicy steak, but it's also about the money wasted on food that ends up in the trash. This food storage dilemma is something that many of us face, and it's not just a personal problem. Globally, food waste is a significant issue, and proper storage can help reduce this waste. So, how can we store food to maximize its shelf life and minimize waste? How can we make sure that our hard-earned money doesn't end up in the compost bin? Well, we have got you covered with 15 essential tips and tricks for storing food for extended periods. First up, always store dry food in airtight containers. This simple step can make a world of difference. Airtight containers are your best friends when it comes to preserving the freshness and flavor of dry food. They keep out moisture and pests, two major enemies of food storage. Think of it as a fortress, safeguarding your food from unwanted invaders. So, whether it's your favorite pasta, rice, or cereals, keep them fresh and ready for action in airtight containers. Remember, a small investment in airtight containers can save you a lot in the long run. Next, freeze your leftovers instead of letting them sit in the fridge. It's a fantastic way to preserve the flavor and nutrients of your meals, and it's also a great time saver. Imagine pulling out a ready-made meal from the freezer on those days when you're too tired to cook. Now, to freeze your food properly, make sure it's cooled down first, then pack it in airtight containers or freezer bags. This way, your food will stay fresh and tasty. Freezing leftovers not only minimizes waste but also gives you a ready meal for those lazy days. Moving on to fruits and vegetables, we have three tips for you. Let's dive right in. First off, resist the urge to wash your fruits and vegetables as soon as you bring them home. Washing them can introduce moisture which can lead to mold and spoilage. Instead, wait to wash them until you're ready to use them. Next, pay attention to temperature. Most fruits and vegetables are best stored in a cool, dark place. Some, like onions and potatoes, prefer room temperature, while others, like berries and leafy greens, like it a bit cooler in the refrigerator. And finally, consider using ethylene gas absorbers. They absorb the ethylene gas that fruits and vegetables emit as they ripen, which can help slow down the ripening process and extend their shelf life. With these tips, your fruits and vegetables will stay fresh for a longer period. Let's dive into the world of meat and dairy products. In the kitchen, these can be quite tricky to handle, but with the right techniques, you can store them safely and keep them fresh for longer. Our sixth tip is to separate raw and cooked meat. Cross-contamination is the quickest route to food poisoning, and it often starts with mixing raw and cooked meats. Always store raw meat separately, ideally in sealed containers at the bottom of the fridge, to prevent any juices from dripping onto other foods. Moving on to tip number seven, let's talk about the first in first out rule. This is a simple yet effective method to keep your meat fresh. Always consume the oldest products first and place the newly bought ones at the back. It's an easy way to ensure nothing gets wasted or spoils. Tip number eight is all about dairy products. These should always be stored at the back of the fridge. While it might seem convenient to place them in the door for easy access, the temperature there fluctuates the most, which isn't ideal for dairy. The back of the fridge is the coldest and most stable area, perfect for keeping your milk, cheese, and yogurt fresh. Our ninth tip is to always check the expiry dates of your meat and dairy products. Sounds obvious, right? But it's easy to overlook. Regularly checking the dates not only prevents spoilage but also ensures you're consuming safe and fresh products. Finally, for our tenth tip, remember to properly seal your dairy and meat products. Whether you're using airtight containers, cling film, or resealable bags, a good seal prevents air from entering, thus prolonging the freshness of your food. And there you have it, five handy tips for storing meat and dairy products. These steps ensure that your meat and dairy products stay fresh and safe to eat. Remember, proper food storage is not just about maintaining taste and quality, but it's also crucial for your health and safety. So, let's keep our kitchen smart and safe, shall we? Finally, we have some miscellaneous tips that apply to all types of food. Let's dive right in. Tip 11. Keep your fridge and pantry organized. This may sound like a no-brainer, but it's often overlooked. An organized kitchen saves time and reduces the risk of food going bad unnoticed. Try to categorize your food items, dairy with dairy, veggies with veggies, and so on. It's a small step that goes a long way in maintaining a fresh food supply. Moving on to tip 12, label your food with dates. It's easy to lose track of when you stored a particular food item. By labeling them with dates, you can easily keep track of their freshness. 
This way, you'll know exactly when to consume them and avoid waste. Tip 13, rotate your stock. This means using older food items before newer ones. It's a simple principle. First in, first out. This ensures that nothing gets left behind and goes bad. Tip 14 is a bit unique. Make a food inventory. Knowing what you have on hand helps you plan your meals better and prevents unnecessary purchases. It also reduces the chances of food items getting forgotten in the back of the fridge or pantry. Lastly, tip 15. Regularly clean your fridge and pantry. Cleaning not only helps in maintaining hygiene but also gives you a chance to check on your food stocks and spot any spoilage early. Remember, a clean kitchen is a healthy kitchen. These general tips will help you maintain a clean and efficient kitchen. They may seem like small steps but they can make a big difference in how you store your food. And remember the goal is not only to store food for longer periods but also to reduce waste and make the most of what we have. Next time you're in your kitchen, take a moment to implement these tips. You'll be surprised at how these small changes can make your food last longer and taste better. These general tips will help you maintain a clean and efficient kitchen. Let's quickly recap the 15 essential tips and tricks for storing food. Starting from the top, we discussed the importance of storing dry food in airtight containers. This not only keeps your food fresh for longer, but also keeps those pesky pests out. Then, we talked about freezing your leftovers. Remember your freezer is not just for ice cream, it's also your best friend when it comes to reducing food waste. By freezing your leftovers, you're giving yourself a quick and easy meal for those days when you just don't feel like cooking. Next, we dove into the world of fruits and vegetables. We saw how proper storage can extend their shelf life, with tricks like storing tomatoes stem end down and not refrigerating your potatoes. Remember, each fruit and vegetable has its own unique storage needs. Moving on, we explored how to handle meat and dairy products. We learned that these items need particular care due to their perishability. From freezing meat to storing dairy products in the coldest part of your fridge, we covered it all. Finally, we rounded up with some miscellaneous tips. We discussed everything from the importance of rotation in your pantry to the benefits of vacuum sealing. And let's not forget the power of labels. Knowing what you have and when you stored it can make a world of difference. So there you have it. 15 essential tips and tricks for storing food for extended periods of time. But remember, these are just guidelines. Everyone's kitchen and eating habits are different. So feel free to tweak these tips to suit your own needs. Remember, proper food storage is not just about saving money, it's also about reducing waste and contributing to a healthier planet. So the next time you're about to toss that half-used onion or those slightly wilted greens, think again. With these tips in your arsenal you're well on your way to becoming a pro at food storage. Happy storing folks! We hope you found these tips helpful. Don't just take our word for it though, give them a try. The proof of the pudding is in the eating as they say, and in this case the proof of the tips is in the storing. So go ahead, implement these food storage strategies. Notice the difference it makes in your kitchen and in your life. See how your pantry transforms from a jumbled mess into a well-organized haven. And when you do, don't forget to share your experiences with us. We'd love to hear how you're doing. If you like this video and found it useful, do us a favor, will you? Hit that like button. It helps us reach more people, just like you, who could benefit from these tips. And while you're at it, don't forget to share this video with your friends and family, they'll thank you for it. Oh, and do subscribe to our channel. We've got plenty more tips and tricks up our sleeve and we can't wait to share them with you. Thank you for watching. Remember, a well-stored pantry is a happy pantry. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks. Goodbye and take care.